Hello students, welcome to part 3, the story of food. Now students, I request all of you to get your EVS books and open page 97 and be ready. Students, let's talk about edible parts of a plant. What does edible mean? Do you know what does it mean? Edible means something which we can eat. For example, mango, banana, strawberry, rice, chapati, dal, curd, bundi, laddu, chocolates, chole bature, etc. So, there are so many things which we can eat. But, can we eat things like table, chair, curtain, tiles, water bottle? Students, you will tell me. What Pratima ma'am? What kind of a question is this? Of course these things are not to be eaten. So students, these things are not edible. Now students, why are some parts of the plant edible? Some parts of a plant are edible because they are fleshy and juicy. Also there are many reasons to this but we will be doing this in the senior classes. Class 3 students, do you realize that all these plant-based food items you have been eating are either stems, roots, seeds, leaves, fruits? Did you realize that? Let's have a look. So, lotus stem, sugarcane, potato are actually edible stems. Onion, carrot, radish are edible roots. Pulses. Sunflower seeds, nuts are edible seeds. And neem, tulsi, spinach are edible leaves. So did you ever realize that while eating? Did you have like a carrot in your mouth and you were thinking, Ah, oh, this is the root of the plant which I am eating. Or you were having dal or maybe rajma which is called kidney beans in English. You are eating that, you are not thinking and you are thinking, ah, oh, you know what, these are seeds of a plant. Or maybe you are having tulsi and you are thinking, ah, oh, this is a leaf that I am eating. Do you often think that or have you ever wondered that? I think most of us don't really think, yeah. When we are hungry, we just eat things without even realizing that it could actually be a stem or a root or seeds or leaves or flowers of a plant. But the fact is that these are parts of a plant. An interesting fact. Now students, it's time for a game. Look at these pictures and tell me the name. Okay students. It's time for some fun. Have a look at these pictures and think. What are these food items called? In any case, I will be speaking out the names in few seconds. So the first one is ginger, adrak. The second one is jackfruit or kathal. The third one is beans or we can specifically call it French beans. This picture is that of French beans. Okay, this picture. Did you say chana? Yes, these are chana or gram. What about this? Kamal kakri, lotus stem. And oh, someone has made lotus stem for us. <gasps> Yummy, delicious. It's making me hungry. Are you hungry, students? Please don't be hungry right now. We have to curb our hunger because we have few more slides to go. Okay, now students look very carefully at the picture on left and at the picture on right. Now this picture on the right is a zoomed in version of the picture on the left. So both these pictures are actually same. They have the same flower. So what is the name students? Guess it. 
Come on. Mm, no. These are flowers of Kachnar. Now, students, Kachnar is a plant which is especially used for its medicinal purposes. Did you get that? Oh, now let's look at this picture on the left. We all know what it is. What it is? Did you say gobi? Perfect. So this is gobi or cauliflower in English. And what about this? Some kind of leaves, right? These are curry leaves or curry patta in Hindi. So students, how was this game? Interesting, right? Students, how was the game? You enjoyed it, right? Now, you know how some food items look like and what are their names. Let's do this exercise. I shall do it on the screen over here. Please pay attention. Once it's done, then you can do this exercise on page 97. I suggest you not to draw lines because then the book becomes really messy, right? Rather, let's do color coding, okay? So, for leaves, we can use green color, okay? I'm just marking it over here for you to understand. For flowers, let's use the color purple. For fruits, let's use the color red. One second, red. Where did you go? Red for fruits. And for any other part of the plant, we shall take the color black. Okay. So that's how we will do in our books also. So let's read the question. The question says, choose the correct basket for each item. So for flowers, leaves, fruits and any other part of the plant, we have to choose our food items accordingly as per these baskets. So let's begin with carrot. What is carrot? Carrot is a... Fruit, is it? No. Flowers? No. Leaves? No. So it's any other part of the plant. So let me circle it with black. What about ginger? Again, it's any other part of the plant because it's not a fruit, it's not a flower, it's not a leaf. Now, what about flowers of Kachnar? We just saw the picture of flowers of Kachnar, didn't we? So, obviously, they are flowers. So, they go with the color purple. What about mango? Fruit, exactly. Mango is a fruit. So, we have to color it with red. That's our color code. So, we have red here, mango, there you go. What about jackfruit? Cut him. Again a fruit. Jackfruit cannot be hidden from us. We just saw jackfruit, what it looks like, right? Amla, again a fruit. Have you eaten amla, students? You have, right? It's nice. It has pulp in it. It has a seed in it. And it is nice. We like amla. It keeps us healthy. What about French beans? Naam to suna hoga. Suna hai na French beans ka naam. Suna nahi hai, dekha bhi hai. We saw it in our slides, right? French beans would be any other part of the plant. So with the color black. What about gram? Gram, your chana. Again, it's any other part of the plant. Now, what about mustard? Now, by mustard, we mean sarso or sarso ka 
tail or mainly sarsoka seed as I can understand. So again, it's going to be black, any other part of the plant. Lotus stem is already done for us. Spinach, palak, palak khao khujan jao. Palak hai patta. So spinach would go in the leaves part or the leaves basket. There you go. Curry leaves, again leaves. What about cauliflower? It's flower. Yes, it is a flower. I know most of you are surprised. But it's a fact that it's a flower. What about radish? Radish and potato. Let's take them together. Are they fruits, flowers or leaves? No, they are not. So they go in the any other part of the plant. Basket. So we have done all except for the last one. Banana. What about banana? It's a fruit. So we coat it with the color red. So let's check students. How many fruits do we have? We have jackfruit, we have mango, we have amla, we have bananas. We have four fruits. And what about the leaves? We have spinach and we have curry leaves. Okay, great. And what about the flowers? We have cauliflower and the flowers of kachnar. And all the remaining items are any other part of a plant. So students, with this, we come to an end of the chapter, the story of food. Hope you enjoyed this chapter, students. Stay safe. Stay happy. Bye-bye.